Greetings one and all, how's everyone doing? I hope well. Got a uh, little product from Rock, uh, Rock Cloud. Uh, maybe I should look into speech lessons too. Uh, anyway, uh, I checked out a, a table I wanted to try and uh, I'll turn the camera down and I'll give you a better look at it. And we'll set it up too. Okay. So I actually had another company reach out to me a few months ago and he, went, he asked me to check out a product for them. And I told them I would. And I, I looked at their website, I looked at their Amazon page, and I said, oh, I, I definitely want, I don't want your table. And apparently they thought, well, we'll just send you the chair anyway, which you can't use. And I told them, I even told them, I said, I'm too heavy for your chair. It's, it's weight rated too low for me. And they just never sent it to me. So, here's the base or the now it's not a super tall table and these things swing over I had set this up once in my bedroom it's a little finicky but all I did I just there's some grooves on the back here and I found that turning it over Come on, buddy. I remember how I set this up now. I don't think it's the wrong way. See, these have these uh, grooves that set in there, but they don't really lock in there. No, it's got to be this way. I had this put together once. I'm trying to remember how it goes now. All right, so here's the problem I'm running into. First of all, these, they, they have a little hole down here. They have a pin. I don't know if I can get that on camera or not, but there is a little hole here. The problem is there's no, there's no tab on top here to, to pin this in and lock it in place. So it, it only rests in the guide. So the, the problem I'm running into constantly is I set these on and there's no way to lock them so they fall down and it, and it sits down too far and then you can't lock the top on. And it didn't come with directions. And then the, the table here, yes it folds, but Every time you push down on it, it, it drops these two bars. I think you gotta lock this, uh, this track over, the, over these pieces here. But as soon as you push down on it, it just folds over. So. <coughs> what a pile of shit. Poorly constructed. All right, so I've been trying to just kind of fiddle with the thing and see if I can just lock it into the tray, but there's no clear indicator where it locks in at. It can't just be because it's cold out here. And then, see, it keeps dropping out of the out of the tracks, and you're going to have it bowing in the center as well. So there's no way to hold it steady. Now I had this together at home and it seemed like it was going to work out well but as soon as I got out here though it's like there's no center support. So anything you put on there with any moderate weight is going to, it's going to snap it. So yeah. Rock cloud. Uh, oh yeah I guess it came with a bag to fit underneath but if you can't get the table together what's the point? 
So yeah, so I wasted twenty dollars. Thanks for watching. All right, so what happened was I was taking some photos, and the camera flash revealed. I get a. There's no way I'm gonna be able to show you because it's just too, way too small. But there actually is a little tab in here that this thing sits in. The problem is it doesn't lock in. It just sits on the. It's like a little nub. It just sits on. So. You know, which brings up a new issue is the foldy part of the table. See, I wish it came with directions, but it didn't come with any. I don't know where this thing's supposed to snap in. It. You know, if, if they just if they just put a marker on the back, like, hey, it snaps in here, 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 and here, that would have made it every that would have made it a lot easier. But they didn't do that. Oh, there we go. So now it's set up. So it just takes some swearing and some work. So I can actually put my hand on the center and it doesn't bow. So I guess it's just, and then it comes with this bag that rests underneath it. So you could probably put like, you know, use it as a trash can or put snacks in there or something. Let's see if I can get this thing off now. Okay, let's just folds over and velcros on. Come on. So there you go, and it's got this little storage area underneath, this little pocket right here, and then, yeah, so there you go. I guess you just have to fight and swear at it, but if they, you know, if they had the tab a little bit taller up, because there's no reason not to, it would have snapped in and it would have been a little bit more firm. So. Yeah, you got the little storage area underneath for like, I mean you can't really get your hand really in there, but I guess you could throw like a headlamp in there or just lift this up every time you want to reach in there and just fold it up like an accordion and access your stuff. Headlamp, cup, book, whatever, while you're sitting at camp. And then it doesn't want to and it doesn't want to unfold. Come on, you piss ant. So, there you go. Rock cloud table with a storage compartment underneath. Um, yeah, buyer beware is all I'll say. If you want to get it, awesome. It's going to be kind of finicky. Okay, so I wanted to share a few final thoughts about the table, and that is, uh, is it terrible? No. Is it great? No. You know, it's got some design features that I would have changed, like, you know, the cross bend members that go over. They should have been longer, so it sits in there a little bit more secure, instead of just popping off super easy. So I don't know who designed it, and why you go and cheap on just a little, little bit of plastic. I mean, if it was just a little higher, it would have been better, I think. So once it got together, though, it, it was pretty firm on top. I wouldn't stand on it, but you know, I'd put a coffee cup and a book on it. So 
I would uh, buyer beware, as I said. So as any, uh, as anyway, as always, I do appreciate you watching, and I will catch you in the next one. And the link for the product will be in the description. All right, bye.